So today I've been talking about how markets are all range bound uh, with, of course, Fed Chair Janet Yellen speaking on Capitol Hill, perhaps more so looking at what's happening with Brexit over in the UK on June 23rd. Um, do you think we're going to push past this little range bound session that we're seeing once we get past Brexit? Yeah, outside of earnings seasons, a lot of macro concerns really dictate and move the markets. And that's why we've been in a wait and see mode, especially with the British referendum happening. I mean, the market seems a little complacent here, don't you think, given yeah. that it's a 50 50 scenario and it could be, you know, a very drastic move either way or another, right? right? So that's a big concern. And we're seeing a summertime slowdown. Of course, yesterday was the official start of summer. Uh, VIX right now, I think, is just about untamed, unchanged. It hit 18.4, but generally, you know, you guys have been telling us that that's really not that high historically. Yeah, the historical norm for VIX is around 20, and you see a mean reversion to VIX, so it tends to overshoot to the upside and tends to undershoot to the, to the downside a lot. Um, but it stayed stable here, and it's actually pretty heightened during these summer slow months outside of earnings season. So this is actually really relatively elevated compared to last year, mm -hmm. but that does reflect the uncertainty, especially because most of the bets that have been going on with a lot of